Hello, my wonderful people. Today, I want to talk about how to get rid of cobwebs. A lot of you today is experiencing this. Cobwebs everywhere, anywhere you go. You see that you're being uh, attacked. Let me use that word, attacked by cobwebs. But before I go on with my teaching, if you're seeing my face for the first time, this is Sijel Lemuan in Miru, the Amphoribon State Nigeria, that is where I live. Here I talk about health and spiritualities. Here I teach you how life is made easy with health, fruit, and animal. Ejimo, wano, na midi, na kwa hini nyo tikashuku jiwe keya, wena azondo. Ikwelo, okun, ya zoke nyo. I have spiritual products that can help you get rid of negative energy and attract favor to you. If you need any of our product or services like consultation, can shout us on our only WhatsApp number on the screen. Let's go. To, let's get into it. You know, most of you are experiencing this cobwebs of a thing. If they should open your eyes to see how strong cobwebs is, something physical, physically, if you just carry it and do it like this, it will tear. But spiritually, it's very strong. And this cobwebs is being caused by negative energies. Ancestral deities that have been abandoned for years without paying attention to them, they use that to call your attention. And some, somebody did something against you. That thing always happened to you. You always witness that cobwebs when you're going for something important or when you are expecting something huge in your life. You see these things happen to you if you're passing on a road Maybe somebody just passed you before you follow that place. You see, when you pass, you experience it sometimes in your eyes, in your legs, in your hand, in your body. Some of them are being caused by your spiritual mates that are dead. No one who came. One day, I'm also to also cause it. How you, you can get rid of it that you will use to get rid of it is fetch a running stream. Carry, if you are a lady, carry seven pieces of alligator pepper. If you are a man, carry nine pieces of alligator pepper. When you put alligator pepper then you put salt. Let's say you fetch the water, you put salt, you, a pinch of salt. You can use sea salt, you can use cooking salt. But I prefer this salt, anamama. This one they use cup to measure, not this iodized salt. I always use that one to do my spiritual work. This salt that they measure in cup. Put a pinch of it there. We still have our local salt here. You can still use sea salt, any one you want. You can use some salt. Then you carry nine pieces if you're a man of alligator pepper or a woman, you carry seven. Speak to that alligator pepper, put it there. Carry any note of your choice, Naira. Without the any one you have, put it in that water. Use that water to take your bait. Take that water on a road, a stretch road. Use it to take your bait in the night. You can do it in the night. You can do it in your bathroom if your where you are staying is not safe. But make sure after doing it, you sweep that bathroom. Put it in a. Even though I know you wash your bathroom for some places that are neat, sweep that place. Take it outside and throw it on a stretch road. But if you can do it in the road, fine. Take it and bait. Then use that money to round your head. Say you're using it to pay whatever thing that is bringing this. Then after that, you go inside. But you still need to do consultation to know the particular spirit that is attacking you like that. So that you will do cons you will you will appease the spirits. Yes, that is what you should do. This life is very simple. The way you take care of your health physically, also take your health, take care of yourself spiritually because the spiritual controls the physical. Yes, do it. I always say this and urge you. When you understand the spiritual code of the universe, you'll be blessed and people around you shall be blessed. All right, guys. See you guys on my next video. I love you guys. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. Please stay safe. Bye.